Today we are testing our new ropes with Snapbagger Rester. It's really exciting. To sleep, uh, it was not good. <laughs> we have tested in a laboratory, but now it's about railway. Basically, SPA, the Snapback Arrester, is a core of a rope, so you can put it inside all 12 strand ropes. I've been working in this rope business for 25 years, and uh, when you read this accident report, you got that feeling that, okay, somebody needs to do something with it. Feeling uh, adrenaline. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's his baby. So he was working with this for many years. I will be very, very happy if it's working, uh, because it's for people on the sea. We are going to test ropes both with and without snapback arrester. The rope is moving with more than 800 kilometers an hour after the break. Mooring operation is one of the most uh, dangerous operations on board the ship. According to the new regulations, the whole mooring deck is a dangerous zone. Every year people are injured or even killed by rope snap. I feel that we should not allow it to happen. The SPA has higher elongation than the rope itself. So when the rope breaks, the SPAs can still elongate. Yes, yes, yes! <laughs> it was working. It's not about making new packaging or making a new color of the rope. It's actually to bring some new technology in it and make it more safe for moving and for other applications. But the ports and the terminals and the organizations are coming more and more with regulations for human-centered design. It is just the ropes, but these are the ropes that can kill people. <laughs> it's working, you know, uh, now we have saved uh, maybe one life. And this is not the end, we are continuing. We have more new developments and this is just motivating us to do even more. <laughs>